Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Ozlander's Break, son. This is going to be on YouTube as break number 685. This is our first and only random serial number case break. 2018 Majestic Football. Thanks to a couple of really good friends, Victor and JT, Clowny Beats Boyd and Best View Cards. And uh, a little bit of help for myself. We cleaned out all the other cases here as personals. This stuff has been pretty good to us. Seems like the general consensus across the board is people don't like it that much. I don't get it. New draft class should be beast. Ricky Premier is coming up here. They'll be coming out with a lot of new products soon. If you don't already follow me on the Breakers TV channel, please subscribe to the Breakers TV channel. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. And most importantly, join the Facebook group. All those links are on breakers.tv backslash Oslander79. I know several of you guys that watch on uh, YouTube have, have messaged me and emailed me and asking me about how do you get into the breaks. Uh, all those links are in one spot on breakers.tv backslash Oslander79. Let's go over a couple of rules of the room right quick. No majority rules, so if we have any dual or triple autographs, which we're bound to have, unless they go to the same NFL team, they will go to random at the end of the break. We're going to roll the dice on random.org one time. We'll use that same, excuse me, that's not valid for this in a serial number break. My bad. But uh, we're going to use that same dice roll for everything. If we roll two, we'll re-roll. Always three and up on the randoms. This is a random serial number break. I'm used to that same rule for every break. Uh, it's been a while since we've done a random. Everybody's going to be randomized at number zero through nine. For instance, if we have a 10 of 99, that would go to the zero spot. If we have a 13 of 50, that goes to the three spot. We go by the number to the left of the hash. Um, if we have any redemptions, unless it's proven on the checklist to be a one on one, in which case it will go to the one spot, they will be random off to everybody in the break. Say we have two redemptions, the first one will go in the first slot, second in the second, and we'll put eight X's and we'll do the same number of randoms as we did for the other randoms and match it back up to our spreadsheet, and that's who they go to. I'm so used to saying that every time, guys, about the, the duels and triples, no majority rules. That's actually a rule that kind of got cemented by our room back in 2013. By the way, guys, I'm going to be taking a little bit of a vacation. Uh, like I said, thanks to Jonathan and Victor for helping make things happen. It's been really slow here since National Treasures with the Majestic. Um, I didn't expect it to all sell out this quick. Uh, we came together and, and broke it all today. So I will be gone until June 8th. This is the longest I've ever stepped away from breaking. Always a little worrisome. Hope you guys don't forget about me. <laughs> we'll have all the new football products coming up. You can always check the Oslanders Breaks release list on Facebook. We got Certified, Elite, Elements, uh, Trinity, Immaculate, Collegiate, all kind of stuff coming up. Next thing will be a new product called Luminance, June 8th. I always keep the most up-to-date uh, release dates. It could get pushed back. Just check the Facebook group. Go ahead and join up. Add some friends. Obviously, ask their permission first, but we're, we're normally doing full case, football, pick your team case breaks. Let's go ahead and get into this thing. You guys don't be strangers. Hit me up these next few weeks. Me and uh, the girlfriend are going to seven concerts in 12 days coming up. I've got a little bit of time before then. Doing some fishing, hanging out. Go ahead and do our dice roll. Anything but a two, always three and up. We're going six times. So six times on both the randoms. Go ahead and do the names first. See them there in the order they were taken. From Rocket Man to Clowny Beats Boyd. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Appreciate everybody jumping in this one. This one did take us a couple days to fill. I said we have not had a ton of traffic other than the first hour of the day, last couple of days. I appreciate you guys that came through and made it happen. So after the random, we got Kevin up top, Jonathan on the bottom. We'll go ahead and make that bigger again so we can see that a little better before I do that make sure we have plenty of room so it doesn't do that to us 
and it's going to do it anyway. Get a little more room. That clowny beats Boyd. That's <laughs> what's doing it. All right, and you see there the numbers zero through nine. Good luck, everybody. Six times on the numbers. One, two, three, four, five, and six and final. Guys, y'all y'all well know that are here right now and in this break that my vehicles broke down, but I'm gonna go ahead and get this stuff packaged up between now and daylight and uh hopefully my vehicle is ready tomorrow. If for some reason it's not, I'll make sure y'all stuff gets onto the post office either way. Fold and make that bigger again so we can see that a little better. K Nelly 83 with the number three slot. Clowny Beats Boy Jonathan with the number six. The zero spot. Best view cards, Victor. Don't get discouraged, Victor. I've seen zero kill it. You never know. Number eight to Mike Rocket Man. Uh, the number one spot, Clowny Beats Boy, congrats. Just had a one-on-one -on -one in the last case. See if we can do it again for you. G.I. Budman, my buddy Steve with number nine. Thanks for jumping in this one, man. Triple Crown at number seven there gets number seven. There you go, JT. Mike's other spot is number five. And my friend in Hawaii, Nelson, long time breaking with the Oslanders break, son. Good to have you back in the fold, son. You got number two. Number two's treated me right a few times. And Clowny Beats Boyd also has number four. Close out his third spot. Once again, this is where we, if we have two redemptions, we'll type one. The first one comes out here, second one there, and then just put X's in the other ones and do the random six times, like I was saying earlier. All right, if anybody else needs to see that again, let me know here. I'm actually going to go ahead and open this up another random, just in anticipation of us having a... Redemption, so I can type it out as we go. Look at that, both Nellies in the same place at the same time. Can you believe it? Oh, I'm going to miss hanging out with you guys. It has been brutally slow lately, but we have some good times. Probably be joining Jonathan during the daytime some. No, he's going to have Tier 1 baseball next Wednesday. If you're interested in some baseball, he's going to have some Dominion basketball too. I don't know much about it. I know they made Dominion hockey a few years back. People really liked it. So the basketball should be good too. Let's try to make it a point to go and join them myself. Yeah, come check it out. Victor's ready to see some rippage. I got you. A whole lot of ripping going on tonight. It's probably been since National Treasures 2016 since we've ripped this many cases in one night. I think I ripped five for Brad one night and that stuff. Alright, good luck everybody. Of course, Jonathan. I tell people all the time, man. Uh, actually, my, I don't know if you noticed, but Rocket Man Mike, I added him to y'all's Facebook group a while back. That's who that was. That's Michael L. Bull and Bob's brother. So I'm always talking about, go check y'all out for baseball. He asked me to add y'all to the group. Or to add him to the group. First up, 34 of 75, Golden Tate. First base up going to Clowny Beats Boyd in the four slot. Yeah, you guys don't be shy about adding folks to the Facebook groups. 
be it mine or Jonathan's or if you guys are already in the group you can add your friends too. Distinguished Defenders, Lawrence Taylor up next. That one is numbered 18 of 25. These cards are tough to capture on camera because you got the shiny gloss and then you got the matte finish. The camera wants to focus on one or the other. This is going to the 8 slot there. Make sure we show that on a Rocket Man. LT2 color. Player worn on that one. Next up, this is a guy we were seeing so much in Contenders draft picks. 214 of 299. So going to the four slot again. Clowney beats Boyd. Out of Western Kentucky University, Mike White. Quarterback Inc. The LT's good looking. And two color. 144 of 199. Look at that four slot. You just never know. John Kelly out of Tennessee. And JT just started uh, singing Rocky Top over there. John Kelly. Yeah, we're just talking about him. Add those to his mountain of stack. <laughs> Well, right out the gate, one of one base of Michael Crabtree. Ooh, another clowny beats Boyd. One of one. Next up, this one is game used. Wow, I'd say so. Look at that. 27 of 49 going to Triple Crown and the 7 spot. Ung Sung Warriors for the Dolphins, Cameron Wake. That is not showing up on camera, y'all, like it does in person. That thing is filthy. Dirty. Old Brad might be interested in that one, JT. He's a big Dolphins fan. Next up, Charlie Joyner. 72 of 99. That one's going to PC Nelly. And the two spot. A little two action. I've had good luck myself with the two, three, and four. And imposing. Wow, it's a one of one. It's got a got a messed up corner. Brian Erlocker. Two one of ones in the same pack. Jersey number inscribed. See there? Good things be happening to good people. Imposing. Brian Erlocker. It's got a little bit of edge wear there, but this top right corner is rough. Might be worth seeing replacing that since it's a one of one. Imposing Brian Erlocker. Our buddy Corey would freak out over that when he's a big Bears fan. He's still on his Ireland Scotland cruise. Yep, he was saying it was going to be a one on one case. That was a one on one pack at least. Let's go skinny first. Well, we know we ordered them from the right distributor, right? They're almost always fire cases. People ought to have caught on to that by now. 13 of 25, Jordan Matthews. Going to K. Nelly 83. Doesn't play for his Eagles anymore. He's a bill these days. That three slot. I don't know if Kevin's paying attention or not. I saw him say something earlier to the other Nelly. On the board, at least. That one's tough to show, but it is a three. Next up. Icons, Michael Vick, going to the one slot, 21 of 49. Pretty cool there. Player worn. I, every time I pull this dude, I pronounce his last name wrong. Uh, Christian Okoye, 95 of 99. I got it right that time. First time we've seen his autograph in forever. Butchered it. I remember when he played. 
Uh, the five slot is who had the five? Rocket Man, Mike, Christian Okoye. Pulled one of those the other day, and somebody said that is definitely going in the PC. And dual autograph. This is pretty cool. Two of five. Ooh, that PC Nelly boy. Alan Page and Carl Eller Hall of Fame Descent. I've got a couple of Alan Pages that have been on Redemption since 2010, but here he is. Bastards. <laughs> Two of five. Alan Page and Carl Eller. The Nigerian Nightmare. Next up, number 19 of 75, Michael Crabtree. That one's going to G.I. Budman in the 9 slot. Next up, game used, Adam Pac-Man Jones, 15 of 49. Going to Rocket Man. Unsung Warriors. Pretty cool right here. Wow. One of one. Randy Moss. Ooh. Oslanders break, son. When the clowny beats Boyd. Brad says, holy crap, I should have got in this. Victor says, F you, JT. <laughs> No effing way, Triple Crown says. PC Nelly, wow. Kevin's on his Lost Boy stuff. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. One of one, Randy Moss. And our RPA. Wow, disgusting. 26 of 49. I'm guessing that's New Mexico Bowl, maybe. Michael Gallup. He's a cowboy these days. That one's going to, hey, Clowney beats Boyd with a six spot. Cool. Cool. This is a good example of why when we start a break, I always set that case aside if some personals or something's done or if another break feels. We had this one setting aside where we broke what? Four other cases? Three other cases? Been marinating up for a minute. DeAndre Hopkins, 37 of 75. Crazy photo on that one. Going to triple crown with a seven slot. It is, Steve. I messaged you when we started, buddy. Or before, probably about 15 minutes before we started. The enclosed player worn Stefan Diggs. 19 of 49 wondrous wideouts. That one's going to the 9 spot, which is G.I. Budman. You have the number 9. You've hit at least one other card. Let me see if I can see right quick what that was. We've already pulled three one ones including a Randy Moss one one Michael Crabtree was your other one so far. We're just two boxes in there. Michael Crabtree, base, 19 of 75. You missed a couple of nice RPAs. The one one Randy Moss. There was a one one base. And Alan Page, Carl Eller to five. Some nice RPA relics. That one base and the relic just now is all for the nine spot so far. Tremaine Edmonds is up next. 32 of 299. This one's going to PC Nelly in the two spot. You did have the Vikings in those first couple. This guy's a Panthers the a Panther these days. DJ Moore, two color out of Maryland. 74 of 99 going to Clowney Beats Boyd with one of his three spots. Oh, crap. 
fumble fingers here. Good thing they're packaged well. We still have three more boxes after this pack, guys, so don't give up hope yet. Next up, 16 of 50. Going to Clown Beats Void. In the sixth spot, Mr. Lou Keekley. Next up. These are pretty cool. Exalt it. We've got ball, jersey, and glove. 19 of 49. Going to G.I. Budman Steve in the 9 spot. Mr. David Johnson. Super cool design they did on those. Next up, Marcel Aitman. 57 of 99. Going to Triple Crown and the 7 slot. And we have a second dual autograph. We have seen a case of this that had two duels and a triple. We may have another one coming. Roquan Smith and Malik Jefferson, 34-49. Uh, that is Clowny Beats Boyd with one of his three spots at number four, black and blue. Does not want to focus. That is... Thirty-four of forty-nine. There we go. Well, the first half produced three one ones. See what we got hiding in the second half. First up, base of Jason Witten, 32 of 75. That two slot is PC Nelly. Up next, this one is game used. Unsung Warriors, a little bit of dirtiness there. 33 of 49, Brent Grimes, a little grimy. Going to K Nelly, 83. Mr. Han. Up next, number 216 of 299, Derwin James. One of Clowny Beats Boyd in the sixth slot. <coughs> Excuse me. He is a charger these days. And we're going to have our RPA up in this first pack. A wide receiver out of University of Memphis. Card number 001 of 199, Anthony Miller. Another one going to the one slot and Jonathan. Three killer. Triple Crown JC says he's good. Looks like we are going to have a redemption. So unless this is a proven one on one redemption, it will be random off to everybody at the end. 48 of 50 going to Rocket Man. Mike with the number 8 slot. Brandon Cooks. Player Warren Showstopper, 23 of 49, Jadavion Clowney going to KNL 83. Kevin. My PC from 2012. Mr. Doug Martin, jersey number inscribed. This one is 6 of 25. Going to Clowney Beats Boyd. In the sixth slot. And what we got here. Marvelous Signatures Gold. That'll be a nice little random. Those gold should be to 10 at least. I think that'll be to 10. Mike Evans for the Bucks. So we'll set that one to the side for the random. I'll go ahead and type that in. And we'll do that same number of times as our other random six times. If we get any more, we'll add to the list. If not, we'll have nine X's in there and match it up with the list. So you're saying they're due. Yep, the gold will be a 10. 
35 of 50, Julio Jones. The five spot is Rocket Man Mike. Julio. Next up, played at Northeast Guilford High School in Greensboro, North Carolina. Player worn Keenan Allen. Wondrous Wideouts, 48 of 99. That is Rocket Man with his other spot, the eight spot. Next up is Rashawn Evans. Another one for Mike in the eight spot, 98 of 99. Out of Alabama, and we have a vet gold ink Charles Haley 31 of 49 jersey number inscribed imposing oh, that one is clowny with the one slot Next up, 57 of 75, 7 slot, Triple Crown, Clay Matthews. Next up, 3 color jersey, 1 color jersey, and 1 color jersey. This first one I've seen that had all jerseys on it. 46 of 49, Derek Carr going to Clowny Beats Boyd and 6 slot. JT says he's killing the base. I know a couple of these numbers have been rough, guys. Hopefully, and pull something out for them here toward the end. Been a lot of repeats. 47 of 99, Dallas Godert. Goddard. Somebody, the Panthers are looking up. Ended up with the Eagles. There you go. There's some ink, JT. This is for the seven slot. And Alan Lazard. Two color. 99 of 199 for G.I. Budman. And the nine slot. There you go, Steve, buddy. You got Got an RPA. I believe Victor is the only one that hasn't got a card. There's a couple that have been a little weak. Alan Lazard. I believe that's the RPA. It's a little thicker, so we'll save it for last. First up in this one, 34 of 50, Devontae Freeman. Climbing Beats Boy with the four slot. Next up, Demarius Thomas. 61 of 99. Clowny beats Boyd with the one slot. Wondrous wideouts. Player worn. Our first ink in this pack is 4 of 25. Clowny beats Boyd with the four spot. Jersey number inscribed. Mr. Danny Woodhead. Gets no hobby love. We were talking about him earlier. Player worn on the jersey. And gold ink. Mr. Stefan Diggs, pretty nice here. 19 of 99, marvelous. There you go, Steve, buddy. Another one there for the nine slot. That's pretty, pretty cool there. Jersey number inscribed. Ooh, I dig that design this year. Having the team color stripes right there makes, makes those look really nice. And it all comes down to the last pack. See what we got. 13 of 75. KNL 83 with the Matty Ice base. Game used jersey. Unsung Warriors. Numbered 1 of 49. First one made. Matt Paradis. For Clowny Beats Boyd in the one slot. And next to the last card is going to be 103 of 299 Denzel Ward. Going 
Going to the three slot, which is K Nelly 83. I believe that might be Kevin's first ink. No, he's a Brown these days out of Ohio State. And last card of the break is a two-color RPA 158 of 199. Dante Pettis for Rocket Man and the eight slot. So it looked like Steve left. I was going to ask all y'all. We could we could give this one to the only guy that didn't get a card if y'all wanted, if we were all in agreement. No Steve left. I know some of those other spots were weakish. Let's see. Mike Evans. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sorry if you didn't do too well on that one, guys. JT says send his cards to Victor. You want to send send the Dolphin to Brad and send others to Victor? I'll make a little note here. I already had a little note to send Victor a mag for the one card. I gotcha. Make sure and leave me a reminder note. Thank you, man. Thanks for hanging out with me so much here lately. So, made it a lot less boring for me, JT. I appreciate the hell out of it. Let's do the random here on the Mike Evans. We're going to screen share mode here. You see it was six times on the random. So six times on the Mike Evans redemption will match it up with the rest of the spreadsheet. One, two, three, four, five, and six and final. Let's see who was the eighth person down here. Whoa, excuse me. So that is going to Rocket Man Mike on the Mike Evans. Should I get it here big enough where you can see it? So congrats, Mike. Mike Evans to 10 gold coming your way. Appreciate it, guys. Once again, I will be gone for a little bit, but I do intend on coming back. Oslanders break, son. He gone.